Jack, would you kindly shed some light on what's happening right now between the Yanks and D.J. LeMahieu? I do think D.J. LeMahieu will sign with the Yankees, Bob, dot, 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 eventually. <laughs> There's an off-season negotiation going on right now. Reached out to one of the parties involved in that negotiation today, and yes, they are still talking. Those talks are ongoing. Those talks are positive. Here's what we know. We reported this on our first hot stove show about a month ago. LeMahieu's side was asking for about five years, $100 million. The Yankees have since countered with about four years in the $20 million per year range. So, to me, that's not the widest gulf to try and figure out. I think there's an easy resolution. I think there is a way to go four years with an option. I think that these two sides eventually marrying or remarrying, there's not an insurmountable obstacle to this happening. Yeah, I think a lot of people heard they're $25 million apart, and it sounds like it's an amazing number. But the reality, like Jack just mentioned, is it's four years or the possibility of five. But I don't think this should surprise any of us. We talked about this at the beginning. I'm sure the Yankees told D.J. LeMayu and his representation, go out there and see what the market is and make sure you come back to us. And just think about it if you're LeMayu. If you want to become a Yankee again and you're the agent, for DJ, the last stop you're going to go to is the New York Yankees and say, can we make a deal? Can you match this number? Can you make it work? I think they're still going to make it work. Do you 